Deciphering Debt and Credit in Accounting. Welcome to our crash course on debt and credit in accounting. In this video, we'll demystify these essential concepts with easy to understand explanations and real life examples. Understanding debt. Imagine you need money to start your dream business. You borrow $10,000 from a bank. Congratulations, you've just incurred debt. Debt is like borrowing money that you'll need to pay back later. It could be for starting a business, buying a car, or even for education. It's essentially a promise to repay what you borrowed, often with interest. Understanding credit. Now, let's talk about credit. When you buy something, there are two sides to the transaction, what you receive and what you give. Credit is like keeping track of this exchange. If you buy a laptop for $1,000 using your credit card, you're increasing your debt, what you owe, but you're also increasing your credit, what you have. It's like a seesaw. When one side goes up, the other goes down. Example transaction. Let's walk through a simple transaction to see how debt and credit work together. Say a company buys $500 worth of office supplies on credit. Here's how we record it. Debit. Increase office supplies by $500 because they receive the supplies. Credit. Increase accounts payable by $500 because they owe the money for the supplies. Conclusion. Understanding debt and credit is like mastering the language of finance. Whether you're running a business or managing personal finances, these concepts are crucial for making informed decisions. By grasping the basics of debt and credit, you'll be better equipped to navigate the financial world with confidence. Now that you've unlocked the mysteries of debt and credit in accounting, you're better equipped to navigate the financial landscape. Whether you're starting a business, managing personal finances, or simply curious about the world of money, these foundational concepts will serve as your compass. Remember, debt isn't inherently good or bad. It's a tool that, when used wisely, can propel you toward your goals. And credit isn't just about numbers. It's about trust and keeping track of who owes what. So, as you embark on your financial journey, may you use your newfound knowledge to make informed decisions, seize opportunities, and build a brighter future. Here's to financial literacy, empowerment, and endless possibilities. Thank you for joining us on this educational adventure. Until next time, stay curious, stay savvy, and stay financially empowered.